Hi guys, so for this headband we will mix two colors and we will use size 6 needles. Okay, so the colors we're going to use are gray and blue and we're going to cast on 20 stitches. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, so we will slip off the first stitch. Purl two. Knit two. Purl two. Knit two. Purl two. Knit two. Purl two. Knit two. Purl three. Slip off the first stitch, knit two, purl two, knit two, purl two, knit two, purl two, knit two. Purl two, knit three.
Okay guys, so after we finish nine rows, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now we'll continue with our pattern. So slip off the first stitch, knit two, purl two, slip off four stitches. Move them to the back, slip off two stitches, move them to the front, knit the two purl stitches. all the two knit stitches then go back to the front cable needle knit two and then Go back to the back cable needle, purl the two knit stitches, and knit the two purl stitches. Purl two. Knit three. Slip off the first stitch, purl two, knit two, purl two, knit two, purl two. Knit two, purl two, knit two, purl three. So after you finish 19 rows of two knit two purl, I will show you what to do next. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Okay, so after we finish 19 rows, slip out the first stitch, knit two, purl two, grab the cable needle. Slip off four stitches, move them to the back, grab another cable needle, slip off two stitches, move them to the front, so we need two. Purl two. We go back to the cable needle in the front, knit two, go back to the cable needle in the back, we purl two, and then we knit two. And then we purl two, and we knit three. So 
So this is how it looks like. We will repeat the same steps after 19 rows and uh, once you reach the desired length for this headband, I'll show you what to do next. Okay guys, so after we've made the headband long enough, nice time to finish it. We will knit the first two stitches together for the entire row. Okay guys, so when we get to the last stitch, we will expand it and we will put our work through it. Then we will pull the yarn and that will finish our work. So the next step is to sew the ends together. So we will grab a tapestry needle. Put the yarn through the needle.
Okay, when these stitches are finished, we will cut the yarn and lose the ends. This is how you lose the ends, and then you can cut the yarn here. So here you go guys, this is how the finished headband will look like. I hope you guys like it, please share and subscribe.